Hi, I'm Trev Hutchings, and this is how to record loops in Zen Beats. First, let's add the drum sampler so we can add a beat. Open Zen Beats and tap on ZR1 Drum Sampler. Now, let's open the pattern view and set the drum loop length. Tap on the pads icon to close the pad view. Then double tap on the loop clip. Now tap on the pattern settings icon. Then tap on the drop down list to the right of the words pattern size. Here I will tap on one bar. The pattern is now one bar measure long. Now let's add a kick drum to the pattern view. The pattern view has a grid of squares. The squares are in groups of four. Each group is either light grey or dark grey. Each row of squares plays a different sound. And to the left of each row of squares is the row header. The row header has the sound name and a play icon. Tap the play icon to hear the row sound. The first square of each group is the quarter note. So tap on the first square in each group on the 909 demo BD01 row. Tap on the play icon to hear the beat, then tap on the stop icon to stop the beat. We can also record live with the pads, so let's add a snare drum. Tap on the X icon. Then tap on the pads icon to open the pads view. Now tap on the arm icon on the loop clip. Then tap on the record icon, wait for the four count in beeps. Then tap on the 909 demo SN01 pad. Then tap on the stop icon to stop recording. Now that we have a beat loop, let's record it to a song track. Tap on the pad icon to close the pad view. Now press and hold your finger on the record icon until a pop-up menu appears. Then tap on record to timeline on the pop-up menu. Notice the record icon has now changed. Now tap on the loop clip play icon to start recording. Then tap on the stop icon to stop recording. Notice a blue bar has appeared to show that the loop clip has been recorded to a song track. Now press and hold your finger on the record icon again until the pop-up menu appears. Then tap on record input on the pop-up menu to turn off loop clip recording to a soundtrack. Now that we've recorded the loop clip, let's check out the song track. Tap on the view toggle icon. Here we have the song tracks view with our recorded drum loop. Tap on the view toggle icon again to return to the loop clip view. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.